Well, hello and welcome back to Wreckfest. I've been playing a career here for quite some time, but the last set of challengers, I, I tried playing this and making a video of it, and it was dismal. Um, it was basically, there's a little killer bee car is what they call it. I, I couldn't even turn the thing. Um, so I was basically just driving in circles, and I don't know, it, it wasn't working for me. So instead, I'm going to go to the custom event. And I've been playing around in here. I, I, I love these custom events because you can configure them well. And there's some pretty zany tracks on here. And I set it up to run as a Razor, which is a pretty fast car that really has no business being on some of these dirt tracks. Everybody's going to be driving it. Hey, about a hard, the only thing that I really have other than hard here is uh, the uh, automatic shifting. So here we are, and this is a crazy race. Let's start. And again, that's ours. And this is nuts. This course is great for so many different types of cars. And, this, and by great, I mean so wrong for them that <laughs> it and then with the damage on realistic uh, this is just gonna be great right. well, you know I'll put the main pack here we go over these because you know this is exactly the type of car you'd want to take over those type of all right. Second place. Early places in this really don't matter because pretty soon we're going to be crisscrossing each other and all sorts of chaos is going to happen. But in the meantime, I will enjoy the fact that I got the first lap. Sure, if I took that well or not. <laughs> I think that would probably injure the car an awful lot more than it appears to. But it never really seems to be damaged when it comes down from the jump, and you'd think that would be like a lot more damaging than being hit or bumped or whatever. I'm way out in front. That's crazy. I mean, I shouldn't say that because that'll jinx it. That makes him in like 25th place or something. <laughs> okay, made it through there. It's weird to be up with the other cars already. Still in first place, amazingly. I think I was too damaged before that. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be uh, going too fast without that wheel. <laughs> oh, well. You pays your money, you take your chances, I guess. Hey. Surprisingly hard to turn without a front wheel. <laughs> it's amazing because I've, you know, obviously I've got damage that is 
going to make this race largely unwinnable from a perspective of having the you know speed and the control to get any type of placement. But if I survive, I can still win. Now that's gonna happen, so it's not gonna be so easy to survive. Yeah, I have to slow down that much to make that turn. Oh, these ought to be interesting. <laughs> Don't think that it's maybe all that realistic of damage if I can drive on three wheels and the car's not on fire by now. <laughs> that turn tighter than he did. <laughs> wow, that really hurt. The the just getting nailed that time and it just knocking that whole wheel off just Uh oh. Not trying to do that, that just sort of happened. Oh, shoot. Turn, turn. Oh, come on, turn. This whole one wheel thing. Well, not one wheel, but three wheel. <laughs> Uh-oh. This is not going to be good, and there's nothing I can do about it. Oh, now my front wheel's damaged, too. My front right wheel's damaged, too. That'll be handy. I don't know, in a weird way, it's almost making it more steerable. Not perfect, but actually I think that made it better. Won't make it better for much longer if I can't make it through that. <laughs> I'm in eighth place. I got one more lap to go. And if there's enough, enough damage done to some of those cars, Could, could possibly get better than eight. The fact that I'm going to finish this, I say that as if it's happened. The fact that it's possible that I could finish this with, I mean, yeah, it was steering better there for a while, but I, I don't think we, don't think that that lasted. Oh. Somebody crash? There's a mod I'd like to try that's supposed to give more realistic damage for when you hit the tires that are stacked up on the side. Uh, that sounds like it could be pretty promising. All right. Here we go. All right, did it on three wheels. <laughs> uh, that's crazy. Only seven finished. That particular race is hilarious. Let's let's try uh, another car. And we'll see see what we get here. Seems like 
inappropriate is the most fun. These are just kind of silly, these like couches. And I tried doing a harvester race in some of these. It just didn't work out. So let's do limos. <laughs> Everybody will be in a limo. And yeah, why not? These should be a nice wide target. I feel like I've been overplaying the, the buses. I haven't necessarily been recording that, but the school bus is such an obvious choice for races like this because it's the most absurd. There you go, first place. Uh, to turn that on dirt, made it. But that was not very good. There we go. I can't believe I'm in first place by this much. But I don't think I took any of those turns very well. So if I had that mod, this car would be broken in half. <laughs> Maybe not. But it would be interesting, like I said, to see more, much more damage. Because right now, those things are... You know, like hitting foam rubber, it doesn't do anything. Uh. There we go. Still in first, or back in first, or something. Okay, that actually worked. I just tried to fling the car sideways and then gave it gas. I was honestly expecting a lot more chaos than this. I don't know if it's happening behind me. Uh-oh. But that caused some damage. <laughs> All right. That's what we're trying to do here. Let's see if that works. Well, kind of works. <laughs> I basically, again, what I'm doing is I'm taking my foot off the accelerator, even giving it a little bit of gas, and just kind of like trying to fling myself in the direction that I want to accelerate into. I didn't execute so well that time, but. Didn't execute that well that time either. I just more brakes, but there we go, like that. And I go sliding around the corner. And by the time I get traction again, I'm heading in the right direction. It's kind of like driving a rocket KSB in some respects. It just you know. <laughs> Point in the direction you want to go and burn, you know? Well, I just lapped that guy, I think. Man, I have a hard time with that particular turn. That was a rather extreme version of what I was doing, and it didn't time it really well, but. That was pretty amazing. That was another badly timed one, but at least it sort of worked. Another one, badly timed. But I haven't seen a lot of T-boning going on yet, but there's not been a lot of separation. Didn't mean to do that. Not unhappy that there's a derelict car in the middle of the road someplace, but. Yeah, so this could be close. No. Yeah. 
Wow, this has really turned into a lot more racing and a whole lot less uh, demolition than I, I really thought it was going to be. Wow. <laughs> that was a little much. He's going to be way ahead of me, so that shouldn't be a problem. Wow. I can't believe I'm this far ahead in this particular race. I, mean, I can't believe I'm... Ah! Every time. I wonder I have a right tire anymore. Right front tire. But for a moment it, it really felt like I was supposed to tune sooner than I than I did. When, it, when I realized there's some fire truck there, it was just my brain seeing that as a place to turn rather than yeah, you know, just a feature of the track. For the last lap, I'm really shocked that I have not seen more of these crossover things being an issue because usually those are quite the thing on this track. And I thought that it would be perfect with the limos because they would all be such a wide target comparatively. But instead, you're just going to see me uh, clean up in this race. Which isn't always a bad thing. You've seen me feel pretty badly, too. All right. Well, I mentioned it before, and it's an easy go-to because it is so absurd. Let's go ahead and do school buses. Everybody likes to see school buses race. And a demolition derby. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Let's keep the... Don't know where the bus is. There's the bus. All right, let's select it. Same as player, everybody's got a bus. All right. Here we go. I kind of wonder why everybody gets in those columns like that, because you can do this. And just Kind of bank off of them all. Get quite a quite a lead. And not a lead, but you know, I picked up many uh, positions on them. Now the nice thing with the bus is the big thing you have to worry about with the bus is is, is rolling it. You can, other than that, besides the really sharp turns, you can normally just keep the accelerator down the whole time. And it's just going to go the speed that it goes, which is, I don't know, about 100 kilometers per hour, 62 miles per hour, whatever, someplace like that. Now, the one thing with buses is there's always nonsense with buses. So, there's a lot of, there's going to be a lot of spread out and, uh, can't believe they're passing me, not sure how, but. All right. Suspension's damaged from that, but no, not from that. <laughs> that seems reasonable. Let's let these guys fight it out. Again, the hard part here is not rolling it. Run. 
lap two, and there's already a lot of, of spread in this race between the people way out in front and the people way behind. So we should see this become, these crossings become a lot more active. And of course, when buses are involved, there's a lot more debris left behind. Over the ramp. <laughs> Whoa, all right. Let's not roll, please. Don't do not want to tip over. <laughs> Once I'm on a straight line, I seem to overpower a lot of them, but then, you know, I think I'm getting ahead, and then all of a sudden, Three of them passed me. All right, well, something just happened back there. I heard the noise. I see the black dot on the map. Yep. Ah, yes. Buses. Buses make this game. I don't exactly know what it means to get a wrecking assist. I mean, obviously, I must have done something to damage that bus in the past. But I, I don't know what the rules are for that. That's a lovely thing to have right at an intersection. <laughs> Right, that wasn't supposed to happen that way. Oh, that was fine. You should have just let me go. <sighs> okay, here we go. There's just so much debris here. <laughs> I must be missing a wheel. Because I am not going at all. I mean, I, this is full acceleration. Well, I've got two more laps. There are probably five people ahead of me because I'm guessing that I am now the last one, the slowest one left alive. I would be shocked otherwise. I mean, this is about as fast as I can go. It's taking the turn okay, amazingly. But I'm not getting anything out of the engine, and it, it looks like it's tilted in the front, so I think that means the tire is if not gone. Pretty bad shape. I'm in fifth place now, so there's only four people ahead of me. There's three of them. And if they start running into stuff like that, that... I could go up. And there's plenty of opportunity. I'm not sure what happened there. There's opportunity to him to hit me there, but Oh, shoot. I still have pretty decent health left. That's kind of amazing. 
and I'm on the last lap. I said I'm going to be the last one to finish if I finish. But I think there's a pretty good chance that they could crash out in all of this mess if, if I'm lucky. They may not have any target left. Yeah, any targets left at this point. This is just as fast as I can go. Really got damaged when I kind of had just ended up T-boning in that, that uh, already derelict bus. All right, we are almost. Almost there. We got this mess to go through, which really surprises me that didn't take some of them. Well, it did take some of them, but I mean, one of the ones that was leading. Is... That's just a mess. I gotta be missing a tire. I, it's there's just All right, here we go. Wow, that was tough. Um, and the reason that was tough was really just because my vehicle was so damaged. Um, saw a lot of carnage, which was kind of the main thing. But I really like this uh, Eagles Peak Motor Park. Uh, I recommend it if you have the game. There's a other direction of the track you can play. Obviously, the ramps um, are set up differently. I haven't played the demolition area, but I love the banger, banger races the best, and this stuff is just, just insane. I don't know why it suddenly picked up the rocket there, but but at any rate, I want to thank you for watching this video. Please click the like button on the video. Please subscribe to my channel. I really uh, appreciate you coming and stopping by and watching me play this game. Have a great day. Be safe.